Annotation of Antonio de Morga, Successos de las Islas Filipinas. So, what is Successos de las Islas Filipinas? So, it is one of the most important work on the early history of the Spanish colonization of the Philippines, published in Mexico in 1609 by Antonio de Morga. So, annotated by Jose Rizal with a prologue of Dr. Ferdinand Lumintreat. So, who is Antonio de Morga? So, Antonio de Morga is a Spanish conquistador, government official, and historical anthropologist, author of Successos de las Islas Filipinas, or event in the Philippine Islands. So, he wrote the first lay formal history of the Philippine conquest by Spain and a doctorate in canon law and civil law. So, the book Successus narrates the history of wars, introduce diplomacy, and evangelization on, of the Philippines in a somewhat disjoint way. So, modern historians, including Rizal, have noted that Morga has a definite bias and would often distort facts or even rely on an invention to fit his defense of the Spanish conquest. So, the successes de las Islas Filipinas have three chapters. So, the chapter one include Magellan and Legazpi's seminal expeditions. So, chapter two to chapter seven is chronological report on government administration under governor general and chapter 8 is uh, philippine islands the native there their antiquity custom and government so what leads jose rizal to successos de las islas filipinas so first rizal was an earnest seeker of truth and his mark uh, and this mark him as a historian Second, he has a burning desire to know exactly the condition of the Philippines when Spaniard came ashore to the island. Third, he believed that conquest of the Spaniard contributed in part to the decline of the Philippine rich tradition and culture. And then, he decided to undertake the annotation of Antonio de Morga's Successos de las Islas Filipinas. So, this is the Rizal's annotation of Morga's successes. First, Rizal commits the error of many historians in appraising the event of the past in the light of present standard. Rizal attacked on the church were unfair and unjustifiable because the abuses of the friars should not be construed to mean the Catholicism is bad. So the successos, as annotated by Rizal, appeared for the first time in the Philippines 68 years later when a publisher in Manila published the new work in 1958 to contribute his bit to the national effort to honor Rizal. So Rizal offered the annotated successos to the Filipinos with a wise counsel and he say to foretell the destiny of a nation it is necessary to open the books that fill that tell of her past it is written by his result